Hey everybody, welcome to Top Racked Facts. Today we're going to go over the top 25 deadliest pandemics and plagues of all time. Plagues and pandemics have ravaged humanity throughout its existence, often changing the course of history. And throughout the course of history, disease outbreaks have ravaged humanity, sometimes changing the course of history and at times signaling the end of entire civilizations. Here are top 25 of the worst epidemics and pandemics dating from prehistoric to modern times. Make sure to watch until number one because it's one of the most astonishing pandemics I've ever heard of. Number 25. Prehistoric Epidemic About 5,000 years ago, an epidemic wiped out a prehistoric village in China. The bodies of the dead were stuffed inside a house that was later burned down. No age group was spared as the skeletons of juveniles, young adults, and middle-aged people were found inside the house. Archaeological and anthropological study indicates that the epidemic happened quickly enough that there was no time for proper burials and the site was not inhabited again. Number 24. The Plague of Athens Around 430 BC, not long after a war between Athens and Sparta began, an epidemic ravaged the people of Athens and lasted for five years. Some estimates put the death toll as high as 100,000 people. The Greek historian Thucydides, 460 to 400 BC, wrote that, quote, People in good health were all of a sudden attacked by violent heats in the head and redness and inflammation in the eyes. The inward parts, such as the throat and their tongue, became bloody and emitting an unnatural and fetid breath. Number 23. The Antonine Plague The Antonine Plague, sometimes referred to as the Plague of Galen, claimed almost 2,000 deaths per day in Rome. The total death toll was estimated to be around 5 million. Thought to have been smallpox or measles, it erupted at the height of Roman power throughout the Mediterranean world and affected Asia Minor, Egypt, Greece, and Italy. It was thought that the disease was brought back to Rome by soldiers returning from the Mesopotamian city of Seleucia. Number 22. Plague of Cyprian Named after St. Cyprian, a bishop of Carthage, a city in Tunisia, who described the epidemic as signaling the end of the world. The plague of Cyprian is estimated to have killed 5,000 people a day in Rome alone. In 2014, archaeologists in Luxor found what appears to be a mass burial site of plague victims. Their bodies were covered with a thick layer of lime, historically used as a disinfectant. Number 21. The Plague of Justinian The Plague of Justinian affected the Byzantine Eastern Roman Empire, especially its capital Constantinople, as well as the Sincinian Empire and port cities around the Mediterranean Sea. The plague, named after the Emperor Justinian I, is regarded as the first recorded incident of the bubonic plague. It was also one of the worst outbreaks of plague in human history, killing an estimated 25 million people, almost 13 to 26 percent of the world's population. Number 20. Leprosy Although it had existed for centuries, leprosy grew into a pandemic in Europe in the Middle Ages. Also known as Hansen's disease, leprosy is due to a chronic infection of the bacterium Mycobacterium leprae. In its extreme form, the disease can cause loss of fingers and toes, gangrene, blindness, collapse of the nose, ulcerations, and weakening of the skeletal frame. Number 19. American Plagues the American plagues are a cluster of Eurasian diseases brought to the Americas by European explorers. These illnesses, including smallpox, contributed to the collapse of the Inca and Aztec civilizations. Some estimates suggest that 90% of the indigenous population in the Western Hemisphere was killed off. Number 18. Great Plague of London The Great Plague was the last major epidemic of the bubonic plague to occur in England. It was also the worst outbreak of the plague since the Black Death. In the space of just 18 months, an estimated 100,000 people were killed, almost a quarter of London's population at the time. Hundreds of thousands of cats and dogs were also slaughtered. Number 17. Great Plague of Marseille Historical records say that the Great Plague of Marseille started when a ship called Grand Saint Antoine docked in Marseille, France, carrying a cargo of goods from the eastern Mediterranean. Plague spread quickly, and over the next three years, as many as 100,000 people may have died in Marseille and surrounding areas. It's estimated that up to 30% of the population of Marseille may have perished. 
Number 16, the Russian plague. In plague-ravaged Moscow, the terror of quarantined citizens erupted into violence. The Empress of Russia, Catherine II, also called Catherine the Great, was so desperate to contain the plague and restore public order that she issued a hasty decree ordering that all factories be moved from Moscow. By the time the plague ended, as many as 100,000 people may have died. Number 15, Flu Pandemic. A Category 2 flu pandemic, sometimes referred to as the Hong Kong flu, the 1968 flu pandemic was caused by the H3N2 strain of the influenza A virus, a generic offshoot of the H2N2 subtype. From the first reported case on July 13, 1968 in Hong Kong, it took only 17 days before outbreaks of the virus were reported in Singapore and Vietnam. Number 14, the Asian flu pandemic. The Asian flu pandemic was an outbreak of avian influenza that originated in China in 1956 and spread worldwide. It was the second major influenza pandemic of the 20th century. The outbreak was caused by a virus known as influenza A, subtype H2N2, believed to have originated from strains of avian influenza from wild ducks and a pre-existing human strain. Number 13, Philadelphia Yellow Fever Epidemic. When yellow fever seized Philadelphia, the United States capital of the time, officials wrongly believed that slaves were immune. As a result, abolitionists called for people of African origin to be recruited to nurse the sick. The disease is carried and transmitted by mosquitoes, which experience a population boom during the particularly hot and humid summer weather in Philadelphia that year. Number 12, Infamous Black Death. The plague has killed far and away the most people, claiming tens of millions of lives around the world. Throughout history, plague epidemics have erupted in several eras, becoming known under different names such as Athens, Antonius, Cyprus, and Justinianus. Black Death, which caused great destruction across Europe between 1347 and 1351, is estimated to have killed 75 million to 100 million people. Number 11, Cocolisvili. Similar to the disease caused by the Ebola or Denig viruses, viral hemorrhagic fevers VHF, are contagious, continuous, and for the most part, lethal. VHF outbreaks swept through Mexico between 1545 and 1548 and killed an estimated 5 million to 15 million of the native population, making it the worst disease epidemic in the country's history. Characterized by high fevers and bleeding, the mysterious illness came to be known as Cocolistoli by the native Aztecs, or the Great Pestilence. Number 10, Cholera Epidemics. The cholera epidemic that broke out in Asia and Europe in 1817 through 1824 killed approximately 1,500 people between the years 1899 and 1923. The biggest cholera outbreaks were in Japan in 1817, in Moscow in 1826, at Berlin, Paris, and London in 1831. The cholera epidemic in the Ottoman Empire during the Balkan War of 1912 to 1913 also caused many deaths. Number 9. Smallpox Smallpox is a febrile, severe, and infectious disease seen in all ages and sexes, showing up as large fluid-filled pustules on the face and all over the body that scabbed over and often left behind ugly scars. It was the most common cause of deaths in history, killing 30% of those infected. There were two types of smallpox, variola major and variola minor. The disease, which was spread between people or via contaminated objects, was more commonly seen in children. Number 8. Typhus Outbreaks There were various typhus epidemics throughout history, but perhaps one of the most notable outbreaks was in 1848, when the infectious disease killed over 20,000 people, mainly Irish immigrants who had fled to Canada to escape the Great Irish Famine. A raging fever, red spots over the arms, back, and chest, delirium, gangrenous sores accompanied by the smell of rotting flesh were its symptoms. Number 7. The Spanish Flu Spanish flu, or influenza, was caused by a deadly subtype of the H1N1 virus in 1918 to 1920. The Spanish influenza is considered the worst in modern history, killing an estimated 50 million to 100 million people in just 18 months. Some 500 million were estimated to be infected by the virus, and its spread was exacerbated by the ongoing war. Number 6. Zika Virus Epidemic 
The impact of the recent Zika epidemic in South America and Central America won't be known for several years. In the meantime, scientists face a race against time to bring the virus under control. The Zika virus is usually spread through mosquitoes of the Aedes genus, although it can be sexually transmitted in humans. Number 5. HIV AIDS Epidemic Human immunodeficiency virus HIV, causes a spectrum of conditions in those infected, leading to acquired immune deficiency syndrome AIDS. About 35 million people have died from AIDS or HIV-related illnesses since 1981, including 940,000 in 2017. Around 36.9 million people worldwide were reported to be HIV positive in 2014. The virus gradually weakens your natural defenses, causing signs and symptoms to occur as time goes on. Number 4. SARS-CoV Outbreak Severe Acute Respiratory Syndrome SARS, caused Asia and Canada to fall into chaos between 2002 and 2003. Caused by the highly infectious coronavirus SARS-CoV, the disease quickly spread to 37 countries globally within a matter of weeks. SARS symptoms included fever, chills, and body aches, and usually progressed to pneumonia. The World Health Organization announced the mortality rate of 10.9%. Number 3. Swine Flu Swine flu killed approximately 2 million people between 1957 and 1958. The swine flu pandemic of 2009 killed an estimated 284,500 people. Just like other types of flu, the disease showed itself in the form of fever, but not always. Chills, body ache, cough, sore throat, runny or stuffy nose, and watery red eyes. Number 2. Ebola Outbreak the Ebola outbreak that erupted in West Africa between 2013 and 2016 caused more than 11,300 deaths. The West African Ebola outbreak started in Guinea in 2013 of December, and the virus spread to 28,616 people in West African countries such as Liberia and Sierra Leone. The epidemic was recorded as the deadliest Ebola outbreak in history in terms of the number of people infected and the amount of deaths. And number 1. COVID-19 the virus appeared in Wuhan, China in late 2019. The new type of coronavirus, which presents itself with symptoms such as high fever, cough, and subsequent pneumonia, have spread rapidly and affected the whole world. However, especially considering the deadly infectious diseases of the past, the novel coronavirus is nowhere near as dangerous nor as fatal as its predecessors. COVID-19 currently has a mortality rate 3.4%. Subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss more videos of what's trending and much more. Check out this playlist of my top 10 videos of vintage history, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.